Looking back to the fall, I think we would all be surprised if the team, the team came along as far as it did this time. Um, we had some unknowns, we had a really potentially good group of freshmen coming in to add to great sophomore class and junior and senior. Um, and, but we really didn't know what to expect. And then as we saw how hard the guys worked at it and how they got along with each other and we started to see Dennis and Sean and Alex all start to grow to a new level of their games. Um, um, started to have some, some hope that maybe we, you know, maybe we're, we don't want to sell ourselves short here, that we could really do something. They started off with this upset over Notre Dame without Dennis or um, Andy in the lineup, which is, most people would think that's impossible. We start to see that the quality of this team is they just would fight it. You just give them a chance and they go to work and they don't go in there with a preconception of how good they can be. And that's a, that's a wonderful quality. We had a tough night against Brown, um, but a good day against Yale a couple of days later. And, and, uh, and it was just hard for them to stay keyed up that long. So they, they, they hit a speed bump, gave us all a little bit of a thrill and a little bit of a pit of our stomach. And then they came out big against Dartmouth the last weekend. I think winning the first round these days, is, it's tough. And um, we had earned a earned a right to be a second, the second seed in this tournament, so we got to turn a team that if we played really well, we had a good chance to beat. The guys adapted well and they support each other well. And the guys are taking exams back at the hotel and, and there, two guys are playing and it was fun. But, but, but they all pulled together, so I think they all grew up a lot on this trip. Andy was a huge doubles mainstay for us, huge singles mainstay for us. Um, he's the, the senior left standing and he still was putting it out at the end. Uh, the match against Sanford, I don't know that I've ever seen him play better. It was a marvelous year. Um, Andrew Rube, my assistant coach, did a great job. Eric Buderak was just a wonderful coach. And we just had, we had great support. And the guys seemed to just like being in that environment and they supported each other. Grateful.